Australia is the second highest producer of waste per person in the world at approximately 650 kilograms per person per year. Without landfill, we would all be walking around knee-deep in rubbish. Cosgrove Landfill is Greater Shepparton City Council's commercial disposal facility. To minimise the environmental impact, the landfill site has required careful planning, time and money before it became a reality. Uh, this site's an abandoned bluestone quarry or basalt quarry. Um, and for the council to turn it into the landfill, we had to um, put a metre of compacted clay in the bottom. Uh, then it's got a fully plastic lined bottom as well and a layer of bluestone railway ballast. And then it's got a layer of GF fabric which just stops any um, silt um, going through into the leachate system. Work on a landfill site begins only after the site passes strict legal, environmental and engineering tests. In the old landfills I used to put a clay cap on so no water penetrated through and I found that um, letting some water go through helps promote the decomposition of the rubbish which means it um, produces more gas so we can um, capture that gas and generate electricity with it so the leachate system's there so when the water penetrates to the bottom it um, goes into a well and gets pumped up to a evaporation pond where it just evaporates. The red lid bin is for your general household waste and is collected weekly. We pick up curbside waste bins, um, we would run them out to the landfill which is run by Shepparton Council. Yeah, the trucks come through, um, they come onto the way bridge, they drive down to the tipping face and um, tip off. Uh, once it tip off I spread it around on the bottom, run over it a couple of times and I push it up the tip face and that, um, I use an onion skin method. Your red lid bin should be used for all non-recyclable items including disposable nappies, small broken household items, styrofoam and packaging. I still get a lot of uh, peat plastic bottles come through in the um, red lid bins which obviously doesn't belong in there. I also get um, lawn clippings as well and they um, spontaneously combust in the rubbish and sets my landfill on fire and that's an environmental hazard so uh, it really needs to go into the, into the green bin. Greater Shepparton City Council has invested in technologies to reduce material going to landfill, to reduce our environmental impact. Population is growing, we're getting less rubbish, we're getting a good compaction rate and um, puts us in the second in, the, in Victoria, so it's a good result for the community.